they clearly get it done on the ground. It's a challenge. Definitely. It's going to be a, definitely a good challenge for us up front to control their line, uh, line scrimmage. I think um, they do a good job of throwing sco um, zone type running uh, where they allow the guys to scoop a lineman out and get to the second level. I think as long as our guys up front, we control the front, um, allow our linebackers and secondary to come downhill and set the edge and fill in the holes, I think we should have a good day. Simmons, I mean, He's so shifty. Uh, amazing back to watch, man. Uh, shifty out the backfield, shifty in space. Um, guy who can line up wide and make plays. Um, definitely going to be a guy that we got to make sure we know where he's at all time. Um, the focus is going to be locking down 22. Um, he's a big part of the offense. Everything really goes to him. So if we can eliminate him and keep him in check, I think we should have a pretty well day, you know? I was going to ask you about Jeffrey. I was talking to him about the difficulties of understanding that you don't have to make the tackle in this league to make the play at your Definitely. position. How long did it take for that to sink in for you? Um, Probably didn't get into about year three. Okay. Um, I think you always want to get out there, as, especially as a young guy. You want to make every play you possibly can. But you understand that, you know, when you blow a guy up three yards in the backfield, and he got to redirect and go somewhere else, and your guy makes that tackle right then. That, that's your play you did made. You know, you you allowed somebody else to make a play. And not, like you say, not every play is designed for you to make a play, but every play is designed for you to go out there and make sure you help someone else make a play. And that's how we do everything in our defenses. Everything is designed to help someone else make something happen. And as long as you can get, understand that, you can go out there and play a lot faster, not worry about, oh, I didn't make a play. Now me, now I'm get over frustrated trying to make a play because at the end of the day, the coach is gonna draw something where it's your turn to go make that play. Kyle Allen is obviously not Cam Newton because he's not 6'6", 270 pounds, but I'm sure it's a different kind of challenge. Oh, definitely. A guy back there can let it rip. Um, definitely move around the pocket pretty well. I don't say he's trying to run downfield or anything like that, trying to trying to run from guys, but he definitely can let that thing sling. Um, we got some great guys around him that make great plays. Um, our thing job is going to be putting pressure on him. Young guy, make sure we get him rattled, rattled make sure we get him um, back there and throw a couple interceptions. He's a guy who, when we get him, get him in the pocket, he fumbled a couple times. Um, so we got to make sure when we get to him, getting that ball out. How happy are you with those turnover numbers this year? They're it's huge. Up, it's huge. Sure. And, you know, it's been helping us out, getting us a good win. So as long as we continue to get turnovers on our side of the ball, put our offense in great position, we've got a good, got a good future going forward here in the last couple, um, next couple games going forward.